So here are my three Hulk poly bags. I'm not a hoarder, but I do like the Hulk. It is Friday morning. Tristan and I are heading to the gym early this morning. We're gonna do basketball today, plus maybe some weights. Later on today, it is week four of Bricktober at Toys R Us for the exclusive. It's a little Toys R Us micro build. And I think if you spend a certain amount, you also get a poly bag of the Hulk, a Hulk poly bag. So that's cool as well. So we'll see what we can get at Toys R Us to get these little freebies. Good workout today. We did basketball, a uh, bunch of shooting, and Tristan beat me again at Around the World. Good shooting. And I had a strategy. You had a strategy. What was your strategy? So I would uh, stay if I missed, and I would just like let Dad keep on going until he goes back to the beginning. To the beginning. Because if you miss, you can have a chance, a second chance to shoot. But if you miss the second chance, you have to go back to the beginning. But he never chanced it. He was playing it safe. Um, afterwards, we did some weights and core. Now it's time to go to Wawa's house. All right, let's see if your bros are here. It's so dark. Yes. I see a bright light again. Here we are at Toys R Us. And this weekend there's a minifigure trade. Not sure if we're going or not. And this is what we're here to get the Hulk minifigure poly bag. So here's the last exclusive build for Bricktober, Bricktober Toys R Us store. And it looks pretty cool. We have the blue Toys R Us store. We have a Toys R Us truck, all mini scale. And this is what we got from the past few weeks, a hotel, a train station, bakery, and this week is the Toys R Us shop. So all these fit together to make a cool scene. And for spending over $25, we got this exclusive Hulk minifigure. So he has that olive green skin, different from the bright green skin that we had with the past Hulk minifigure. So this is a new guy. Nice collection, nice addition to the collection. And to reach $75, the first set I got was this Star Wars set, Ray Speeder. So this is from the new movie, The Force Awakens movie. We got Ray, we got uh, Thug there, Unicar Thug. And it's a cool little set. Here's the back. You can see some of the features here of Ray's speeder. And you see this in the trailer, the new Star Wars trailer. So I'm excited to put this together. I also picked up another speeder, Ezra's speeder bike. So this is from the Rebels cartoon. And you get Ezra, you get Sabine Wren, and a Stormtrooper. And on the back, Again, you see some features here as well of this speeder bike. Plus you get a speeder bike for the clone trooper or stormtrooper, I mean. I got this Star Wars Rebels battle pack with more stormtroopers. The build is not so exciting, but more stormtroopers is cool. And here's the back as well. The features. And another battle pack, the Genosis trooper battle pack. So again, these look like stormtroopers, but they have this, um, it's kind of like a brownish, reddish brown camouflage going on there. Plus a little kind of a moving vehicle. Oh, you got four. Okay. Four stormtroopers. That's pretty cool. I mean, not stormtroopers, Genosis troopers, Geonosis troopers. I'm here at a second Toys R Us right now. I went to a Toys R Us earlier this morning to get the poly bag, the free poly bag, the Hulk and the Toys R Us. I'm here at the second one. I'm not trying to get the Toys R Us. This time I just want to get another poly bag. So I have to spend over $25. We'll go inside. Hopefully they don't sell out yet. I saw on Instagram that they're starting to sell out on these, um, or just run out of these Hulk poly bags. Toys R Us store number two. And again, the Hulk poly bag. Hopefully we can get it. These are a bunch of Star Wars sets here. A lot of Star Wars. Hmm. And Ninjago too. That's uh, construction. Here's another new one from The Force Awakens. And these are superhero sets. Have a bunch of them already. Some of them I don't have. I don't have that Sandman there. Hmm. I can get this one, the Ant-Man. That's a good one. Oh, they have a bunch of mystery machines. I haven't seen these at the store at all. Cool. 
And I still need this Jurassic Park one, Jurassic World. And here it is, the exclusive Hulk minifigure poly bag. And so this is the second one we got today because earlier today we went to another Toys R Us and I shot some footage of that as well. That will be in a different video. But this is the cool Hulk that he's breaking up this buggy or whatever it is. And uh, let me show you what I purchased to get this. So I got this superhero, this Marvel superhero set, Ant-Man Final Battle, where we get uh, Yellow Jacket, Hank Pym, and Ant-Man. So three minifigures. Plus this cool looking, I guess it's an ant or a fly. And some, well, I think it's supposed to be a Lego piece, but it's zoomed up and a screw. And on the back here, you can see some of the features. Nice super jumper there. So it's a cool little set. So this one was $24.99, which, or $24.95, something like that, which is just a little short of $25. So I had to purchase something else. So I got a Mixel. I got a purple Mixel, mostly for that bucket. I haven't seen that purple bucket before. Plus those um, purple slope pieces I might use for something else. But not sure if the boys will like this. It's purple. But they'll get over it. It's not friends. It's Mixels. So now I'm at my third Toys R Us. Ready to look for another of those Hulk poly bags. Hopefully again that they have them and they haven't run out yet. Toys R Us store number three. And again here is the Hulk poly bag giveaway. And a bunch of superheroes and some Star Wars. Here's the minifigure trade. Minecraft. These are some of the new Minecraft and the collectible minifigures. Oh, this is cool. Expensive though. Might wait. Hmm, what else? Oh, Lego Dimensions. Some more fun packs to get. Not getting those yet. And some more constructions. Tristan likes these guys. Cool. And they have the Mystery Machine here too. Nice. I'll probably get this one. So here it is, the Hulk poly bag. My third one of the day. My third Toys R Us today and third Hulk poly bag. And so I took footage of the last couple and those are out on different videos. But this video here, we have this Hulk poly bag. Hulk is smashing up and breaking up this um, buggy. And let me show you what I got. For so it. I got this Scooby-Doo set, the Mystery Plane Adventure. We got the Headless Horseman and Shaggy and Scooby. The plane is just okay. It kind of looks like the mystery machine, but it is a plane instead. Here's the back. So some features there. Oh, you got a horse too. Oh, of course, for the Headless Horseman. And that is the secret identity of the Headless Horseman. So I think the big draw for me might just be the Headless Horseman because I've gotten Shaggy and Scooby on other sets. I'm not sure if these are unique Shaggy and Scoobies for this set. I'm not sure, but, and the horse. Not sure if I've gotten this exact horse before. And I got this poly bag because I was a little short of $25. And it is just a tiger. So here are my three Hulk poly bags. I'm not a hoarder, but I do like the Hulk. It's Friday after work. We just changed this guy's diaper. Or I should go to the gym. I'm so tired. I was literally trying not to fall asleep during the afternoon today at work as I was doing some paperwork. I don't know, I haven't been sleeping very well or maybe that's been ongoing for a while now. But uh, I had to pull a stop on these boys because they were really rough and tumble and my mom was getting mad at them. There's one of them, where's the other one? I don't know, he's hiding. Does he not want his iPad for a full month? Are you not listening properly? He got in trouble in school yesterday for being silly. I'm telling the world. No! So how should you behave? So we're trying to download this new app for Mason, which is called Prodigy. It's a math game. Hey! And uh, the school is encouraging them to try it out for their math skills. Oh, gotta do this. Da, One second. Da. Here, here, here. Look. <laughs> Did you listen properly today in school? Yeah. Are you sure you didn't get a silly note? Yeah, I didn't. Did you do your 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 um homework? What do you do? 